this is my week. Wow. Look at this fog. That is pretty thick. I'm gonna try and cross the road here. Uh, 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 don't hit me, car. <laughs> My goodness. Like, I can't even see, like, there's, there are traffic lights, like, up ahead there. There are traffic lights back there. Can't see them. This is wicked. So anyway, I am just walking to the corner gas station to pick up a paper. And I suppose this is all you're going to see this week, sorry. It has been kind of a boring week. My health has been up and down. It, it's Sometimes I feel good, sometimes I feel bad. I've been off my uh, meds for a couple of weeks and that hadn't helped. I started slipping back down, losing weight, so got back on those quickly. And I'm starting to bounce out, but I'm still suffering. I mean, thank goodness this morning I can walk to the corner store. Yesterday morning, wasn't able to do it. But anyway, I'm just uh, taking you outside because it's just, this fog's amazing. I haven't seen fog this thick in a long time. The thing is, I mean, it's it's daylight. I mean, you should be seeing sun somewhere, but you stay here. <clears throat> Just so I don't know. Feels kind of like uh, something that's in like in a movie or something. Like, I can't even see like up there is where we live. And I can't see it right now. That is so weird. So as we're walking down the fog, and I think, well, I don't know if the fog's lessening or not. No, not really. It's still kind of to where I can't see anything in front of me, behind me, except like, uh, I'd say about 100 yards just around me. That's pretty much it. And then everything else is just total, total blindness. But sorry that this week hasn't been very good. Next week should be good though because we have Thanksgiving. So we'll be doing Thanksgiving things and then maybe something else too. Eh? There might be uh, something else going on. But I'm not going to tell you. You're just going to have to wait and see what happens. Okay, I think I can barely see the traffic lights up there. Then I can also see um, the lights of the gas station that's uh, kind of red. Up there, reddish. And the traffic lights are green, right? Now turning yellow, okay, now turning red. Wow, it's just, it's amazing, this fog. Yeah, gonna, okay, there's the gas station coming out of the fog, okay. So. I'm gonna need a paper, I'll see y'all in a minute. Okay, so I got my paper, and there's the gas station. Back there is the traffic lights, you can't see them because of the trees though, hold on. Yeah, back there is the traffic lights. And you could still probably not see them right. Oh, oh they're turning yellow. See? <laughs> We're just walking. <laughs> um, can barely see the traffic lights. 
can't see home. Can't see home yet. Okay. Uh, uh, I can still see the traffic lights a little bit, but they're disappearing. Keep on going. Yeah, this ooh, this fog is thicker. I can I can feel it in my eyes. Okay, I think I'm gonna cross the road. Look, you can't you can't see the track. You would never know that there was traffic like in a gas station over there. You wouldn't have gone over there yourself. And you don't know what's down there either. Oh now. From a filmmaker's perspective, this type of fog is like a filmmaker's dream. Like, if I had actually a good camera crew, I'd be like, Okay, everybody get together! There's a fog! We need to do something! We need to film something for this. Because it's just like... You have just... From one end... To another... You can't really see much of anything. And that gives you... Like, if you had an actor, and it gives you a sense of... Isolation, you know. I think it's just you, and the whole world is just closed off to you. Lights are gone. Now, no, I just gotta get home. Let's see how long it takes for. We need to see our place. Okay, I can see home, sort of. It's right after these little fences. So, I'm Ryan. I hope you enjoyed our little walk together in the fog. I'll see you next week.